Waste of time tonight. Absolute waste of time. <sighs> Where's your thirst pan? That's you. Out or... No, this is a practice match. Because oh. Crowds is being a fucking asshole. Like I don't know where the fuck he's gone. He's just just fucked off. Like just a complete cunt. He is. Doesn't go. Doesn't tell anyone where he goes. But you know that's that's just him in a nutshell, really. Honestly, I can't be fucked. There was no. I didn't want it to be Friday. I generally didn't. I wanted it to be on Sunday. Mm. So I knew it would be able to, for one person for it to be on a Sunday. Just a fucking joke. So there we have our bands, Mirror and... Um, yeah, pretty self-explanatory bands, if I'm honest. Just, just rank settings, really. Nothing peculiar. So. Who's, Who's what? Lay. Lay is Adam. Okay. <clears throat> Who's Jimmy Jeffrey then? That's Owen. Oh, okay. They've swapped teams because they just thought these teams were fair when I don't really agree with these teams. That's not fair. Having Corrigan and Adam on the same team isn't fair. <clears throat> In my opinion. Well, practice match is not the actual team, so. Yeah. Defenders, protect your bombs from being confused by attackers. Setting trauma pack here. Uh, uh, Schroeder looks confused. Did you see that? He look, he look ever so confused. Bless him. Let's go back to him. Look, he looks. He's, he's oh. you on your first stage, EG. Look, he's, this is you on your first stage. See, just frost. I can hear now. Yeah, I've changed to I've changed it around, so it's fine. Oh. Yeah, so I wonder what he's doing. This madman is up to nothing, really, isn't he? Oh, well, radical pain. No, we're trying to take out Lee Star's drone, and he got it. So we got Montagna, which was predictable. This is what, this is what, obviously, I think Josh, I think Josh hit him there. Um, but yeah, this is obviously what he was going to do anyway. They're, they're already expecting this. He's already in the Legion. He's got to take out that Legion at some point. They're all here. So everyone's in, everyone's just around here right now. I don't know what's going on. I just might use an impact to look in the... No, he can't actually. Yeah, he's good at them. Oh. At least I nearly had that... Nearly had the first kill there. It's going to be between... It's going to be between at least I and Hodge here to get the first opening pick. I'm just trying to take out the ace breaches, but I think the ward's going to be opened anyway. And I'm just checking for anyone coming from the round the back, but everyone, every attacker is on this side of the wall. 
Trodo with the first opening pick onto Elite Star. Holy shit. Vertical ping now, dual kill onto Jimmy Jeffrey and Zonefish and Hodge. Clean up path. Flawless round for the defenders. What do you make of that round, Gigi? It happened very quickly. It was quite slow at the start, and then it, it was went it, really fast. Well, they all pushed that one end. They all pushed that one yeah. that one one corner there. And I think to myself, why? Why? Did, why did you need to push that? That was just yeah, just stupid in my opinion. But yeah, showed up with the first number pick, and obviously this is a practice game, so obviously this doesn't count mm -hmm. for the official tourney. So it's a big rip, really, because Ralph. <laughs> You know, fun fact, Ralph actually holds to having the most first opening picks of all my all my tournaments. He killed Adam. Yeah. I think he killed no. I know he killed Adam in the first tourney. It was the luckiest like from Dirt Tunnel. He was Thatcher and he just shot him. <laughs> and I think someone else got the opening pick onto Adam as well. So Adam's had the most opening deaths in a tourney. But who who knows when the actual tourney happens, but there's obviously this practice match he hasn't died yet. Bring out Flores. I was going to say that. Does Josh even know how to properly use Flores? Because he doesn't play it often. I don't know. He's, I think he's using him a bit in rank two of us. Yeah, but pure, poorly, poorly executed from um, team. We're going to go with team path because team because path is at the top here, isn't he? So we're going to call it team path. <laughs> so. <laughs> So I feel I feel like they need to re rethink about what's gonna happen for the second site. Got Virgil Peng on the cap can, Adam on the rook, Showdog with Frost again, and Hodge as Caviero. Well we know Owen means business now because he's moved off from a shield operator to uh, a hard breacher. So hopefully he will do something with that. They've mostly all spawned together, but Obviously, Nick is Nick. He doesn't give a shit. He wants to be on it. He wants to do his own rogue go alone route, which is fair enough. <clears throat> Let's see where Hodge is right now. Hodge is just checking if anyone's on this end of the map. And pretty much, dude, no one's at the end of this map. All focused on skylights. Jimmy Jeffrey, though, opening a bit of the wall up. Shrodo just getting some rounds in, just getting some practice. Hard on the flank. Sees just trying to wait and see if anyone is out there. No one on cam, so we ca can't really confirm it. But he is being, they are droning people. Shrodo, no, in a very bad situation here. He might die here if he's not lucky. Drones are all over him. All these drones are on him. So Hodge is going to come here and protect him. Yeah, Hodge is going to protect him now. Shrodo taking some damage from Path, but Path strikes back with some damage on to him. Shrodo's letting Hodge know, but he already knows this information. First pick, at least starting to Shrodo. For the second round. Can he get his second? That's on to Adam. Nice double kill there. Now he's just gonna try and see where he can find little Caviera because I they they already know there's a cap can and they already know Caviera at this point. Yep. So Puff's gonna come on in. He's gonna see what's available. Yep. Owen's already in sight. Probably gonna let Puff know to plant the fuser. No, Puff just running around with the diffuser and that's gonna cost him his death there. But at least I will clap back and superfish will clean up to kill vertical peng. What did you make of that round there, Gigi? I was just like quite confused, to be honest. <laughs> confused with the game initially, or their no, their strategy. Like the <laughs> other team, one of the other teams, just what they were doing. Because mm. they went out pretty fast. Like they died pretty fast. Well, Showdog was being an idiot. Like I'm gonna blankly say that. Because he, yep. he was getting droned to fuck. He was in stocks when people were shooting at the window at him. He then pushed his path at the double windows. Now, if that was someone else and not path, he probably would have died at that point. Right? So he backed off and then obviously it got him. Then Nick said, fuck it, I'm getting involved now. I'll take those double kills. Easy. I don't, I don't know what he was doing in the crouch position there. He should have just stayed in sight, really. Because Owen was droning outside and just thought, fuck it, it's free. 
Pap had the bomb, which was a bat downer because he could have just planned the bomb, but it, it didn't make it, it didn't do anything at the end of it because it just well, the round was done, cleaned up the kills yeah. instead of planting. So, on to the third round, though. Got a Sophia out and a Maestro and a Pulse for this round and an IQ. Bomb located by attackers. I know Surface is just quite good today, so he's bringing out the guns. Just saying. Oh. <laughs> oh. Watch him die first now. Watch him die first now for the for the logic. Yeah. Nah, he, he's, he's a good shooter, really. He has his ups and downs, but he's, he's, a, he's a good lad, isn't he? <laughs> right, Owen has the diffuser right now. I think he's got a hard breach into sight. I'm not sure. Because Owen thinks he's probably capable enough to try this. Yeah, if he's going to try and hard breach into sight or use it as a, a distraction. He's hurt. He's hurt the maestro. Actually, Ooh, was that somewhere else? I don't know I what happened. I don't know what happened there. There was an impact that happened. I don't might get the kill here. If he just holds his shot. Someone out shooting from the far side, which is Elite Star. IY now on 1 HP, GG. He's in a very critical position and he dies from Owen on Pell the repel. So right oh, 100%. <laughs> 100%. Puff taking out Virgil Peng now. It's a 4v2 in the situation. Things are lining up for the blue team. Now. Is Jamie Jeffrey gonna push into sight here? Because I don't know if they've got the intel to know, like, hey, we, we can plant in here right now, but we still got Shrodog to deal with. We got we got Hodge out of sight right now. He knows that Shrodog is gonna die at any point, so he needs to do something at some point. He's gonna get he's gonna use his nitro out at some point. He's he's waiting for a, a bomb. He's waiting for a plant to go down at some point. He sees Josh. He thinks Josh might have the diffuser here, so he might try and have a little have a little gander. He's just waiting to see who's gonna stop, right? He sees that he sees it. Froze. Boom. Deleted two off oh the board. Two v two now, but Puff will take out Shrodog. It's a one v two. Can Puff find another position to, to to plant the bomb? Yes, he will. At least I was gonna try and provide some cover, thinking he's gonna push that way. But Hodge has already come back into sight. He's, I think he sees Puff, but he does not see. Elite star in this position. Elite star now holding angles here. Everyone's holding angles. But Hodge needs to do something and push here to try and win back this round. Path is very convinced, but Elite star wiping Hodge off the board. What do you think of that round, Gigi? How did you feel with that um, double nitro cell? Yeah, I was going to say it was quite good because the fact that he got two rather than <clears> just one. Was what, really good. Well, I mean, Josh, I think Josh should stay too long near Owen where the bomb yeah. was being planted. Maybe Josh should just stay away from Owen, you know, It'd probably do him good. What? <clears throat> uh, anyway, 2-1 two, two, now on, on the board. Uh, we're going into <laughs> round four. We bring in a zero out and a cap and out. And Rooney is coming out to play too. And Owen's old fashioned smoke, smoke. is being played. And a lesion. Legion was already played previously by Hutch, I remember. Anyone got a six pick from this option? Elite Star is going to six pick to a Vigil, probably. Or a Jaeger. He means business. And Hodge going to the knock. Oh, Caviera. Okay. Okay, I smiled that but they both know who's six picked. <laughs> Cause they weirdly enough, they six pick a lot, GG, in, 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 in tournaments. They do it the most. So So we swapped to um you know swaps we swap sides now. Blue team obviously will be defending and the orange team will now be attacking. Now, as you can see, Smoke is opening rotation holes. It's pretty simple. So let him let him deal with that. Silverfish will just be making some rotations of EDDs. 
walking, he's walking around, not running around, but you know, it is what it is. We start. Just reinforce some hatches, which you should be doing too. Did you? I, I know you don't do hatches. All right. What? I'm just saying. When's the last time you? When's the last time you reinforced a hatch? Hmm. Next question. Next question indeed. Next question indeed. Hodge is gonna be droning the garage because I think he's gonna get his team to push this way or cause a distraction through main lobby. Pafto is being droned out currently. Paf doesn't care about the drone, so he's just gonna hold an angle here. Yep, Hodge is just gonna wait on him. <laughs> just casually wait on him there. He's like, yeah guys, we got a we got a lesion in garage, so just make a distraction. I'll I'll take care of this. They don't know about the caviera though, GG. So mm. the cav could spring things into action with two in sight right now. I don't know. Coming down the main stairs. See if you can get a pick on someone. He's just heard Path throw his legion, taking that out. He took it out. You took it out. Don't worry, mate. But he's gonna make sure though. Trodog and Virgo Peng just following Adam wherever they go while Hodge is on his rogue mission. Now he's just gonna he's gonna see what drones he has left. Doesn't really have much, so he's he's, he's thinking. Nah, I don't know if I should take this route. I'm gonna go a different way. I'm gonna go a different way around, really. Alistar though knows that. Oh, the least on no can hear the knock here. Can he get the down in this position? I think Hodge can see something. And and there's the down. Oh, and there's the interrogation oh, oh. by Alista onto Hodge. Now can Eric get the trade back here? Misses all his bullets and Eric goes down. It's a 4v2, Jimmy Jeffrey onto Virgil Peng. It is up to Adam in a 1v4 with his position revealed outside of the back alley, GG. What are your thoughts currently on this round? He's going to die. He's not going to do well. <laughs> no, no, no positivity. No, like, um, he could get yeah, no. all four kills. No, he won't. M maybe one. <laughs> I don't reckon. reckon the four. He's going to try and get in a contest with, with Owen, though. Owen is going to pressure him. I know he will. Owen will pressure him with the M. With the shotgun and boom, deleted. There you go, you see? The fact that I had to be on Owen again. <laughs> you know, you know Adam's gonna be free, Chris. Like, he's just died to <laughs> Owen every round. <laughs> like, he's on three deaths. Like, did he die to Owen in the first round? I don't know. Owen does have three kills. So, I mean, but it could be one of the others. No, he died to Shrodog, didn't he, for the first opening pick? I think it was, I think it was Shrodog that, that killed him first. But yeah, match point now, GG. 3-1 to the <laughs> Paths team. <laughs> Just, um, I'm expecting a bit more from Sewerfish, if I'm honest. Expecting from Sewerfish, yes. He's at the bottom. With one and two, but his team's winning comfortably, though. That's all That's all that matters, really. It's not about yeah, who's at the bottom. Yeah, thanks to Elite Star. Thanks to Elite Star, obviously. Every, Elite Star yeah. shit, yeah, exactly. Every day of the week. Elite Star, though, giving me a troll six pick. Are you really going to troll me like that? Oh, you really are gonna troll me like that. Fuck you, Nick. Lisa has trolled me. He's going to the tanker just to wind me up because he knows I don't like the tanker. <clears throat> but yes, 3 1 now on the scoreboard. Time to switch it up. See who's gonna win this game. I mean, like, no one can. No one can really complain, Gigi, because we they, there isn't an et to, to sweat his yeah. ass off. Let's be honest. So, Ten so it's not that bad. Ten seconds remaining. Bomb located by attackers. But you know, let's see how let's see how we get on. Five seconds to go. Path though on the Ella. That's gonna be interesting to see if he gets a if he can get a pick on anyone there. All right, looks like they're gonna do a push through um in into bank. Well, Oh, server Rex, I believe, sorry. It's gonna be a hard push, GG. I can see this. Going to be a hard push here. 
by Adam and and uh, Hodge. They're just trying to figure out what to do here. Schroeder, no, Owen and Vertical Peng now having a little fight. Seeing who's going to win that fight, but Vertical Peng takes out Jimmy Jeffrey, aka Owen. All right, we're bringing it some. Gonna get that. I that know. Time. We're bringing to bring some strength back for the Irish team, and that's how you do it. The Irish power so coming in strong. We've got two minutes left on the board, so hopefully something can come about about this. At least that does here. Ostrodo has taken out Superfish though, but he sees Hodge. Can oh, can Adam get the trade? Sure. Yes, Adam will get the trade. That was kind of it bad. Is, it is now a 2v1. And yes, Adam, I did see that. Don't think I'm, I have uh, I have more beers. I did see that. It's a 1v2 now. Can Path Clutch against the Great Republic of Ireland, Vocal Peng. <coughs> Sorry, Northern Irish. Just Irish bastard. And Adam. And what is that noise? What is it? That is a weird noise. Did you hear that? Just clatter. Just random ass clatter. Yeah. I don't know. Gonna push from to spiral stairs now. He has. He doesn't have the diffuser, whereas vocal pen does. And vocal pen is just gonna wait, just waiting, really, seeing what he can do. I wide oh, taking some zero cameras out, seeing what he can do. But he is being scanned right now, so they are. His position is being told to path. I'm gonna be quite surprised if Path clutches this because I think I'd be pretty impressed. I think Hodge will be if he clutches with Ella. It's not. It's a bit hard to control the recoil at the minute. Only a rare few can control it. So, 40 seconds remaining on the board. It looks like it's gonna be a double push from either end. Virgil Pen gonna probably push through the closet, while I Wide's gonna push through the hallway corridor. But Virgil Pen will shut Path down. Three two. The score. Now, I mean, GD, do you believe that Elite Star was getting a little bit too cocky for his boots playing Tachanka in open area? Yeah. He was indeed. I, 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 I think he was. The fact that Hodge didn't see him was weird to me. He, he came in and then he then just realized, oh shit. But luckily Adam was there to collect the kill or else it would have been a Probably been a bit of a disaster for a 1v1 situation. Or oh, 2v1, because, you know, at least I would have been alive if he took out Adam. But nonetheless, we could we could see Blue Team winning this final round or go into overtime. <clears throat> We're just trying to see who's got a six pick now. Anyone got a six pick? Showdog, Hodge, Path? I don't think they will. No, no one's gonna six pick. We're gonna keep the same teams. <clears throat> Attackers need to locate. Hey, no, oh, geez, I'm gonna ask you some questions. Team. Who's your uh, who's your favorite defender and why? Um, defender is it's probably it's either Cav only because <clears throat> Cav's quite fun. This Cav's fast. Cav is fun, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, or Frost. Because I don't know why, but getting like <clears throat> people in the frost maps just feels satisfying. Oh, 100%. I used to, yeah. you know, fun fact, I used to main her when Theme Park came out. This was before I knew Hodge. I used to main her a lot. I don't know why I play her now, to be honest. I just really stopped using her now. Jimmy Jeffrey, they're trying to get that camera out, but I don't know if that actually went onto the, the tree. He's gonna do some fakery jifferies, but oh, he did land it. He oh, did yeah. land it. It's pretty, pretty good. He sees one on, sees one out there, which is vertical peng. Vertical peng could die here if Owen does a run out. He sees another one as well. He sees two people, which is capital too. No, it's not the capital. It is um, Hodge, I believe. Yeah, they're both up. They're both up top now. Shoto, I don't know what you're doing, mate, but he's. <laughs> Yeah, you you do you, mate. You do you. Anyway, how about an elsewhere? We got three on top of Skylar on top of the roof. Of you know, Owen's just checking for any intel bases. Uh, at least uh, just chilling in open area in the same position as before. Silverfish roaming around, looking in the lift for some odd reason. Oh, he sees one. He sees a Shrodog. 
but at least I will take that kill as they were both in line for that. 4v3 now, not looking good for the orange team to make it to overtime. Can they do something here? Jimmy Jeffrey now will take out Virgil Peng, but Hodge will clap back, taking out Sewer Fish. It's a 3v2. Nope, Tyler Lai, it's a 2v2 now. Adam will take out Owen. He has got a revenge kill all that time. Took him a while. Anyway, 2v2 now. Path and the least of us is Hodge and Adam. Lisa just taking his time. He, I think he knows someone could be above, but he doesn't know if they're on skylight. Half just chilling around. At least I is being scanned. The information is being said. I don't know with the diffuser at hand, but he's gonna come onto the roof to join Hodge. We're just trying to get some more intel. They got a minute left. What is your prediction for this round to go, GG? Who do you think is going to take this round? Um, I have faith in Pat's side. Right. Okay, I do believe that Orange team will be fair. I'll say Orange, you say Blue. We'll see how this goes. Yeah, but to be honest, under <clears> pressure, <throat> I think when Adam's under pressure, he does well and it's getting close to the time. So... You make a very interesting point there, which we won't go into right now, but yeah, that is a really good point about Adam. Anyway, at least I will be just watching just to see if no one see if someone peeks this. It is it is Hodge that he, he may be waiting on, but he's just gonna wait the time out. Just wait the time out. See what happens. Seize Adam! Adam will take out Elisa with a headshot. Path though! It takes out Hodge, but Adam gets the trade. I'm surprised. I should have seen. I wanted to see that POV. That's a shame. But anyway, we are going to overtime. Blue team couldn't hack it to win their four point victory here. So I saw what uh, Lisa was trying to do. He was trying to make the, the time run down. The pings were coming in, but it wasn't strong enough because he was only getting he's only pinging they were they were pinging adam but they weren't pinging i think they were pinging hodge actually sorry but they weren't pinging adam so when he thought he could look and lean over the vending machine adam just comes out and say hi mate i know you're here because i'm coming this way and obviously that's what happened but the fact that path killed hodge was very interesting to me so that's paths definitely improved then but so just said that he's not able to sprint or lean left yeah, I've realized that. I think he couldn't do yeah. it in the last tournament on Outback. No. <laughs> he needs a new controller. No, we do have a six pick. Jaeger coming out Attackers instead to, to a Caviera. Oryx coming out for the first time of this game. And a Blackbeard. Just, just to trying to annoy some people. Eric, though, with the, sh the Ying shotgun. Oh boy. Bomb located by attackers. New feed active. But yeah, we'll um it's over time. Meaning I believe they need two or more to win, I believe, right? GG? I Five think that's right. If I remember rightly. It's just ranked yeah. like ranked settings really, so attackers objective is to defuse a bomb. Yeah. <clears throat> so it's gonna be interesting. See how it goes with the black beard out. This is gonna be very annoying for the for the blue team. But a cav though, and especially elite stars cav, it's gonna be a little bit cocky. They need to drone him out. They need to find where he is and exterminate him. Because if they don't, yo, you're gonna be running with uh, a very a very sneaky cav that's gonna kill everyone. Believe me. Anyway, we do see lobby pushes though. But nothing onto Elite Star just yet. Elite Star is just gonna be waiting. He's look how close they are. Look how close they are. Elite Star is gonna come around and have a little look. But he gets droned, so he has to back off now. They know where he is. Jimmy Jeffrey will take out Adam. Path taking some a bit of damage, leading him into three bars. Trodo running around like a maniac. Vertical Peng, no spraying bullets, but couldn't get anything. Omen will take him out. It's a 4v2 now. Surovich has took some damage though, I believe. So he's gonna come back to site. 
Blue team look comfortable right now, GG. They've they're just gonna hold silo with ball. Oh they've just talking out Shodo, but Path will nick the kill from the uh for no interrogation. And at least I'll be nice to say, you know what, I could team kill you, but I'm just a nice guy. I'm not gonna TK. Okay. Now Hodges up to his own south, and he's just sitting out waiting for anyone to come towards him. But I don't think they're gonna do that, GG. I think they're just gonna wait the time out, if I'm honest. Yeah. Poor little Hodge. I do think this round is the path. No, path Hodge. Uh, uh, Hodge can Hodge can work some miracles when he's in a good mood. Don't don't underestimate him. He knows that Valkyrie's out right now. But I think someone is aware that he's coming this way. I think it's Path. No, it's not Path. No, side side's free then. Side could be free if um, any information was told about this. He just needs to be aware if anyone's coming on the flank. And I believe Leak Star is coming, but Path takes him out with a headshot. That's two kills. Path is taking out Hodge. I'm just. I don't think it's in his best interest to do it in the minute. But hmm. well, for the score, GG. What did you think of that round, though? Again, it just happened quite quickly. That it seems to be like a recurring thing on Hodge's side that all of them die quite quickly, and then it gets left to one quite quickly yeah it, it rounds can go to the distance but rounds could go very quick it depends on what strategy is going to be present so sometimes when we do play ranked on console we will do strats that will just rush in as fast as we can to exterminate anyone in sight and plant the bomb and then get it done we own the site any romans need to come back and try and get us hmm. Whereas going the distance, meaning we'll take, we'll get a wall out, hold some peaks, hold some angles, try and get Romans out. It's a bit of a bit of a gamble, but you know, there's different things for different strategies, really. Like this strategy right now, um, Mon the Monty coming out, meaning the Monty's gonna provide a lot of cover for his teammates and provide a, a, a strong push. And if you're someone that is experienced with Monty, you won't, you don't focus on the Montagne. You focus on the players that are pushing with the Montagne because the, the players are going to try and push you out because you're going to come to the, the Monty so they can get you. So you would want to get them out, really, and not the Monty. Unless he comes into a the position Owen is in now where he's not got his shield open. It's a bit of a, bit of a better way to go, but for now... Strong push, I believe, for this team again. No, no one's pushing with the Montagna. I think, I think Owen's just gonna just do it on his own. I believe. But now, um, information has been told to Hodge though. Hodge is the only one in sight, I believe. Oh no, it's I, I don't. My, my bad. A nice, nice headshot. That was oh, a lovely good, headshot. Yeah. yeah. So three v four now. Could, this could go to 4-4 if it plays well. They've still got a, a caviar roaming around. I thought it was Cav there because of the face paint, but I was, I was wrong. Do I? Yeah. These soldiers are trying to drone out the Cav or droning out anyone potentially roaming and can't find him. Josh, though, should have saw that Valkyrie. But I don't think he did. He's got to push up with another drone. Please stand out. He's just holding his his own favorite place again. Where is the uh, the cab? The cab is just hiding in closet right now with Shrodog. This might alert some enemies here. This might push Hodge to come this way if he knows his, these doors are being opened. These hatches are being opened. Yeah, some information is being fed about this. Hodge does know. Trodo will push around, see what he can gather here. He's holding out the second shotgun, but will obviously fail with that fight. It's a 3v3 now. Hodge needs to get the tray back or do something really there, but he will just hold out just to play some time. He's he's got time. They've got they've they they've got the fuser right now, so they can just play it easy. 
Sarah so fish trying to find anything you can take out any utility so I'm just gonna stop anyone coming on this side Adam is just gonna hold main stairs and Josh gonna provide pretty much but IUI takes out sewer fish they know where IUI is now on main stairs what the fuck is going on there well path you just got eliminated by Hodge it's a 1v3 now Lisa running away <laughs> running away in an old-fashioned manner but he's taking some shots and he's gone I, I I can't believe Hodge actually knife papped to down him. That was actually quite hilarious to be fair. <laughs> so fair play. So much point, GG. What it takes all. At the start, I thought that um, Path's team was gonna like, because they started off quite well. I was expecting them to win, but then Hodge's team has brought it back quite well. Well, you gotta remember. You know, Josh doesn't play Siege much. Owen doesn't play console mm. Siege much. Laystar plays console, so you know he's the best player. And Paffy doesn't play Siege at all. Well, Hodge, Adam, and the other two are, are like, they don't play Siege. But Hodge and Adam, they are used to pressure and used to knowing mm. when rounds are being lost. You know, we've come back from a 3-0 three, three game or 3-1 game and just put it back and win. You know, times like that makes you know how good of a player you are. Because it just, it just, it just shits on your team. When a team is so high up to get knocked down, it shows you how great you can, you can bring on Siege. By but we have got a Vigil and a Maru, so I think you already know what's about to go down. And when I say about to go down, I mean... Some of these windows gonna be opened and just yeah, yeah. The of a bomb. And, a lion. and the line as well. And we know what we know the uh Omen and Adam strat, the line yeah, Amaru. Yeah. So he's gonna do it, provide it for Hodge for this one. Now, Vigil can counter this line counter to stop if you didn't know already, GG. When he's in that ability, he can avoid anything by all means. But the Amaru though, can he get, is he going to get an X-Star boy PTSD or will he get the, a complete a victory here with this shit? Vertical, not vertical, Owen getting taken out, path to be taken out. It's a 4v2 now, ease. Oh Trying to see if there's anyone going to come back to site now. So if it's an open area and lead start on the third floor. Trying to see if we can find anyone. Oh, Owen, no, Owen, Nick, did you not see him on the window? That was, I thought right there, he, he heard Hodge, but Adam played it well to distract Nick there because he had to do something, but he froze up. He tensed up. Now it's up to sewer fish in a 1v3 now and God rest his soul. You do it. <laughs> you believe in your top, man. All right, what? I'll put it. Watch him die, but he can do it in my opinion. You mean he'll get a kill at least? I think he can get a kill at least. Maybe. If he doesn't see the player on the left. How is he not dead? What the? Did you, did you see them bullets? Yeah. <laughs> What the? Was he breakdancing, avoiding them bullets? I, I don't even know. But winners are Team Hodge against Team Path. Pretty good. Pretty good. Good practice game for Sunday. So, yeah, not too bad. Just show you the scores real quick before I end the recording. But there you go. There are the scores. GG. GG.